In this tutorial, I want to show you how to understitch around the Ansley pinafore, the neckline. So of course, in, in this, um, you can see that the main has already been sewn to the lining. That's, that's already done. And the seam allowance on the inside has already been trimmed and clipped. So we are ready to understitch. This is just an optional stitch but I do find that it does hold the lining in place, especially when in the garment is being worn. So I like to do it on, on, um, on certain garments. And in, before we understitch, you can just go ahead and um, easy way to mark the stop and uh, starting point of your stitching, understitching, is just to um, insert a couple straight pins at the beginning and at the end. So then, you can kind of see the length of it and you can um, kind of uh, predict the beginning and end so that it's not uneven. All right, so let's go ahead and start understitching. And before we put it underneath our, our your um, sewing machines, but you wanna make sure that the seam allowance is pointing to the lining. And so of course, the main has the interfacing on it, so pointing to the lining. Let's go ahead and put it underneath our foot there. And I like to stitch about one eighth um, inch away from the seam allowance. You can back stitch it in the beginning if you, if you want to. And just go ahead and start um, under stitching on the lining. Of course, nothing will be stitched on the main. It's just free from any stitching at all. And as you're sewing, just keep on checking to make sure that the seam allowance is pointing to the lining. And then when you get to that next pin or whatever marking that you chose, um, you can just go ahead and back stitch again. And then take it out. And as you can see, there's the understitching. And we did it on the lining, but of course, on the main fabric, you don't see any stitching. So that's like the little secret of understitching. I, I think it's so cool. Um, and if you open it up, you can see that it was, it grabbed the seam allowance. So it, it's going to go ahead and secure that to the lining. And then um, for the underarms, you can just go ahead and do the same process for um, just the underarms around the pinafore. So there you have it, understitching complete. You'll just wanna um, go ahead and cut off your strings there.